you and Bring it. a trained theater professional. <laughs> All right. Words from my as yet conceived daughter. You know, my parents really loved each other. I know a lot of people say such things. However, I really mean them. More than anything else, it was important to see that they weren't afraid to show each other affection, rather at home or in public. You see, it's kind of important with my folks. My father always said it was as a result of my grandfather, he who could always show affection to the women around him, though a baby boomer. It's interesting to think of them, my parents, writing, praying, creating, dreaming of me even before I was born. Named in honor of my great-grandmother and beauty, I come from a family of artists and myth-makers, peoples of islands and island faiths, water children, a sea goat, a crab, living in the intersection on an island where salt and fresh water meet. Like them, I straddle cultures, straddle time, straddle the impossible. Fear was never an option, never an opportunity, not for me and fearful times. And I remember my mother saying to me, I want you, girl, Miha, to say, my parents really loved each other. Or, at least, you said you would help and heal me for now until forever, or at least until tomorrow. <laughs> I'm taking each of my tomorrows one day at a time, or at least I try. You tell me that the future isn't that important, that I need to weigh into the water only up to our today, or at least only put a toe deep into our tomorrow. And I notice you need healing too. The forest of your eyes, brown, not green, seem to confirm the need for my reassuring silences, or at least my ability to support the strength that courses through those eyes of yours. As recently as this morning, I thought all my love lyrics had gone dry, that I had fallen into matrimony to find the feelings behind our love unfathomable. At least, I found the comfort no artistic match could ever thrall. However, there is no need for another Dionysian monument to sweaty palms, to racing hearts. Love in the present is as good as love in the past. When your kisses give life to me as I'm standing with my head deep in the sink, when my heart calls out to you, even when the TV is flickering and I need to battle for your attention, that's as much love as it was before. And it does that this morning. As I sit on the train and I feel the drag of this pencil across an almost forgotten notebook, or at least a lonely notebook, and I find myself transfixed to the to that, and I find myself transfixed by that man's left hand next to me as he glides over his own page. In this moment, your dominant hand, left as well, just like mine, flashes in my mind, and I am brought to the beginning of our memorable moments, or at least to a moment when memories proved themselves useful. Thank you.